yo 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 what is up everybody thanks for clicking on another video today we're gonna hop back into some hogwarts legacy uh we'll pick right back up where we left off in the last one we woke up in the room and now we have all these other quests to get going so let's just hop right on in um i hope you guys are all having a great day and uh yeah, let's kind of see. Blah, 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 sorry, let's kind of get into some shenanigans and see what we can unlock today. Hello, Mahora. Hey, about time. All right, let's uh, let's start on that so I can start doing um, lock picking and all that fun jazz. Let's see. So, you're, should I even go to it? No, I think you're already in the same wing as me. So I'll just uh, come find him. All right. It's funny is I haven't really like explored my little dorm very well. It looks pretty sick. It's very botanically, very like oh look we're in the Shire kind of uh, essence, a little bit of the essence. All right, let's go up this way. Oh, oh wait, hold up. Was that a? Was that? Oh, it was just a reflection of the mirror. Okay, I thought there was a page right there. Don't know what she's stuck on. Oh, the door's up here more. Whoops, running into stuff. Alrighty. Wait. Oh, look, we found Mr. Gladwin. Let's go talk to the man and see what he's got before us. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Mm, typical. Somebody needs my cool there. help. Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. It is night time now. Oh. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon <laughs> from the statue. Did it, bruv? Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, hmm. which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Okay. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. <gasps> you see, oh, no, not you. Hogsmeade, Why? I you seem so cool. With a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demigod. Sorry, man. Take a quick little honeydukes passageway hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch is a secret passageway from Hogwarts to the cellar at Honeydukes. It can only be accessed using a particular charm, which I don't think my homegirl yes. knows. Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Cool. Oh, look at that. Terrible. I see me a little chest right here. Let's go. Take a quick little... The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my hands. <gasps> Some jackanapes use the boggart to learn my greatest... Jackanapes, huh? ...and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? 
A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Yep, that's Second, me, for yes, sure. Macabre and idiot as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't <laughs> bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Uh, perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. All right, but first... Why would I do this? Seems all risk and no reward. Oh, rest assured, there's very little risk and there is, in fact, a reward. I will teach you a particularly useful <laughs> spell. <laughs> Okay. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However, will you get in? Mm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, ah, tosh! <laughs> I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue <laughs> this is an in the old fella. bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Uh, technically, I didn't really say I was going to go, but, you know, cool, cool, cool. Here we go. Man, I feel like I haven't learned a new spell for a little bit. Here we go. Hwishwa. I have now learned Hello Mahabra I can now unlock doors Alright, let's put it on That one I guess Oh, what? Oh, it's a, okay Hello Amora uh, Use the left and the right To move the gears and rotate dials Until both corresponding gears are activated To release the lock Sounds easy enough. Uh. Yep. <sighs> Don't worry, well I'm an expert you lock mean, picker, sir. Yeah, 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 bro. I heard you. Uh, there. Boom goes the dynamite. <laughs> that little lock was no chance for my awesome power. Ay. Dear Maribel, my dear dot has been asking after you. Perhaps I can convince her to stop in for a butter beer too if you were to join us. It's been far too long. <sighs> when you do manage to come by, I wonder if you'd be able to part with a few of your plants the more fragrant ones ever since the troll attack customers have been complaining about the smell of believe it or not old socks nothing i've tried seems to cover the stench hoping to see you soon with or without the plants your friend serona oh all right, all right. i know miss serona in here okay let's get up out of this room nothing okay da, da, da. oh heck a no um, I'll scroll down if you guys want to pause and actually read this one yourself this one's pretty long eh. okay it won't let me scroll down there we go and this should be the last Alright, let's continue on. Let's get some. Alright, level two. Okay. Alright, I guess now would be. Alright, yep, the time to. What? Oh. There we go. Go invisible. 
Uh, reminder to staff, the Hogwarts house elves do an exceptional job of keeping the castle in order. They are seldom unprepared for any number of items that they may encounter each day. However, only the other day, an unexpected stash of wizarding crackers went off from behind a cushion. The cacophony was most uh, untoward, engulfing one poor elf in blue smoke and giving uh, those of us nearby in a, a domino ringing in our ears for the rest of the day. I expect that the culprit was peas. Please keep an eye out and be careful. Matilda Weasley, deputy we hit missed with. And I feel like I kind of got a little tongue-tied with that uh, that little note. Uh oh gotta be sneaky actually let me see let me go check my talents because I know stealth oh okay well can't be super super sneaky but I got some level of sneakiness All right. uh, if the doors aren't in there I'm just gonna go up or if the doors, wow, that was dumb. If the demi guises aren't in there, I don't really care. I'll just keep going up and continue on. <gasps> Rather holy, I'd say. Do, do, do. What? Is that so? You can't see me. <laughs> Suckers, thought you could catch me. My sneak level is over 9,000. <laughs> oh, okay, where are you going, dude? Must be the priest's oh, no. bathroom. Uh oh, gotta go quick. Uh, right. Where to go? Where to go? Come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry! We gotta go. He's gonna snitch on me. Get me in. Okay. <laughs> made it. Made it. We're good. So it's weird. Why would I get in trouble by these kids if they're also students? Like, wouldn't they get in trouble too? Being out and about? Okay. I gotta see where that other guy went. Okay, he's over there. Alright. Peace out. <laughs> Today would have been the day that you almost caught Captain Brendan Sparrow. Alright, Unicorn Fountain. The majestic Unicorn Fountain gives an air of serenity and calm to the hospital wing at Hogwarts. Did that do anything? Nope. Oh! Okay. Alright, that might have actually been a bad idea because now they're more spread out. Oh, okay. Cool. So she's leaving. I know you want to see a winning belt. And Ravenclaw would not have been that. Not this year, anyway. I'm right. puzzled to Hufflepuff myself. <gasps> you guys can't be biased. You're professors. You're supposed to just... Alright. Okay. Cool. All right, here we go. Let's sneak up out of here. Finally, going to learn the Quidditch rules. Oh, it's a majestic no. sport. Encompasses the whole of the human condition. Oh, how's that? Well, love to stay in chat, but <laughs> I've got better things to do. Oh, where's that one kid? Okay, he's still down that hall, right? See ya. <laughs> Oh, that's what's up, baby. Didn't even get caught once. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Okay, you know, I think I can I'll stop and get this real quick. I got time. Sure. Field page guide. Jewel encrusted tortoise shell. Many assume this shell to be of a fire crab native to Fiji. However, those in the know swear it's a bejeweled tortoise shell created by a mad wizard near Versailles. When his chateau was overrun by Nifflers, the dazzling shell was carried off to be discovered years later by a Hogwarts professor on holiday in the Ardennes. Ardennes? I don't know what that... Oh, 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 hey! Don't come this way. No. You go away, you little... Oh! Don't do that, don't do that. Alright, let's put that there so I can grab that book. Or page. 
No, what? That. There we go. Alright. Okay. Get out of here. Come on, you little dingus. Get the hell out of me way. Oh, what are you doing? You in a stance up with a bookcase, bro? Well, come on. <laughs> Idiot. Alright. Oh, he was the one that was guarding these doors. Are you going to come back down? Any of these level one? Ooh. No, what? Whoop, 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 whoop. Bing! Cool. <laughs> you suck it. Oh, he's coming back. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, okay. I'm about to talk crap and say he sucks at his job as he catches me. Uh, that one's not too long. My darling Abraham, you would have been... Yeah, blah, 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 blah. You would be overjoyed to know that the local children have taken to playing gobstones in the street just outside your study window. They're quite... I don't know. Maybe I should not read that yet. I'll read that in a minute. Just in case he... No. I didn't want to get caught, and I was thinking maybe he... What the... Oi! Tis the luck of the Irish! Oi, yeah, yeah. Hmm. It's cool. Alright, let's just... No! Alright, let's get rid of a gear piece right quick then. Cool, I'll just delete this one then. Bye-bye! Okay. Alright. Uh, I feel like I actually need to start equipping this new gear that I've got. It's been a while. The eighth. Three, let's go. Uh, better gloves. Face where I think I did check that last game or last video. Did I get new 33? Well, you got the best stat and you don't really have any traits, so it doesn't matter the color. Let's check the robes. All right. Okay, let's get out of here. And let's get actual spells that would make sense to have, because that's only for the room of Tumman's Figuration, or the requirement room. But these are trends. Yeah, you guys get it. Y'all smart cookies, too. Okay. Uh, okay, cool, you're up there. Never to you. Oh no, I'm not smart enough to know it. No. Alright. Haha, <laughs> no more sneaking around for me. <laughs> okay. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh goodness! You're as fearless as I do. Mr. An moon, the moons I've got us here for ye. If we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxnead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar, and I have something to offer in exchange <laughs> for your assistance. I love how I'm not. A, I'm just now, a person. Remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. All right, buddy. Understood. I shall keep. I shall out. keep an eye out for him for you, especially if you are the way that I get my increased. Oh, I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it, so we can solve this. Yeah, 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 bruv. I gotcha. All right. So now I can start unlocking level one stuff, which is beautiful. Beast quests. Uh, sure. Why not? Let's go. Night. Let's see, do I have... Eh. Uh, I don't have it there, but at least I have something that's outside. So we'll go there, make a quick hop scup and a jippity-doo-doo. -doo. And we can go get 
there's some beasts. Right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on, you can make it. You can make it, my little friend. Just jump a little bit higher. Come on. Come on. All right, I got another fast travel point. We shall wait, and beast class shall begin momentarily. Ugh. Man, this floor was so scrum diddly dumptious for my sleeps. Whoa. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how mm -hmm. to handle them properly. All right, teach me. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howland. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howland's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, <laughs> please. The tongue of a puskeen can be a slippery devil. <laughs> uh, yes, Professor. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Gerald. You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think. Oh. Let's go here. We'll put it there. I like to think it enriches his experience. Ooh. That's lovely. Man, we'd be hecka lazy in the wizarding world. We don't even want to brush the pets come. ourselves. Would you mind giving him some beast food? Uh, I'm guessing that is another. Okay. Yeah, sure. No biggie. I'll just, you know, I'll do all the work for you so you can just sit there and get an A off of all of my hard work. What do you suppose the pellets oh. taste like to Gerald? Oh, no. Heading, he I a frog for real. He's going to go... I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. Jeez, you ate three at once. Damn, is. man, you a f very little well. chanchito. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. All right. Good work, everyone. Now... Let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. All right, Please, let's go. Do be careful as you feed and groom them. Yes, ma'am. Why don't you show our new student to the measles in the father's pen? Measles. This way. The measles are over here. Um, okay, I was just going to say, I'm assuming it's those uh, cat light looking thingies. <clears throat> oh. oh. Couple of knees or whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something for honey jeeks. <laughs> Slithering kids always up to the trouble. <sighs> Stupid thing. <sighs> what in Merlin's name are you doing? <sighs> tuss, tuss, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her <gasps> name is Persephone. Oh, hey, I know Persephone. Persephone. Man, you guys are some little <laughs> buttholes. So Let me beat the crap out of you two. You need a lesson in manners, young man. <sighs> yeah. Let's go. Hit the road, bozo. Oh, that thing is ugly, though. Just uh, putting that out there. But that is just my own opinion. Some people Let's might find these things incredibly adorable. Us. I don't. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Uh. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. <gasps> oh, I'm a good egg. Yeah, right. It's so nice of you. Has come to an end. <laughs> was I supposed to go inside the pen? <laughs> Where right. is our new student? Mm. Ah, Diddy cups. Those kind. Those like look cool. I like those you. things. Oh, they're cute. Oh, I feed you. I will brush you. I feed you. Wee. 
And then I brush the little one. Oh, he's... Oh, is that the one that was teleporting over in the class and stuff? Okay, man, you eat slow. All right, I'll feed you. And then... Okay. All right, Professor, I've gotten some extra credit. <laughs> Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? Yes. I did. She did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? actually pretty cool. I like this, this little mechanic. Wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. I don't know if you'd want to use that control board. Magically mm, just, material. yeah, you know, it's we all be vibing together. We all be living in harmony. Just like, you know, them cool stuff. <gasps> you well see that, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. <laughs> Those <sighs> little bums. Sadly, oh, the they make me so angry. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The ministry, perhaps. Hmm. Nope. It's going to be me. An optimistic idea. Now. Why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Okay. Well, I already have been been. But, uh, but, 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 but I've already been spoiled that you can catch me, so uh, hopefully I can start getting can those soon. That'd be sick. You. Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You yeah, that's really cool. You seem like you're a nice little kid. I, I got your back, girl. Me and you. Got this. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Mm. All right, let's go. You've intrigued me. Very well, lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Hey, so I, I, I trust this girl. She seems really cool. All right. Don't take just anyone there. Bobby. In fact, you're the first. <gasps> Are you? special? Well, oh. Thank you. Uh, I'm Again? stuck. There we I go. Said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. <laughs> oh, well, uh. It's quite the weather we're having, don't you think? <laughs> Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. <laughs> Could just tell me too, but you know, it's cool. Don't we just, I'll be following you. There. It's just ahead. Na, 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 na. Oh, cool! I can do my little teleportation thing. Oh, cutscene. Stand back. Stop. Um, no. It's the hippogriff. I think I pronounced that correctly. Hippogriff. Something like that. Please meet High Wing. High Wing she just is adorable. Go on, introduce yourself to her, but be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy. Okay, that was pretty good. Them. Like spot on. I did it. I am a genius. Oh, I be bowing. Damn. Oh, even more so? Okay. Oh, snap. I guess a bow two out of the birdie birdie. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every <laughs> once in a while. Bring her pasties. Tell her what's <laughs> going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her. You hungry? She's a Got some nibbles. Busybody. Oh, I like Miss High Wing. Miss High Wing, can I be your new bestie? Oh, she gone. Shh. 
she's so amazed. Like, nah, man, we just natural. People love us. So, what did you think of Hiring? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me brilliant. to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. <laughs> did you know that once you earn hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Hiring cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got Damn her to safety and, well, poachers. she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry yeah. they could get her again. And that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poacher's influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm mm. just not sure what. Well, I will... That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. Um, I will I think offer my idea. assistance. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep hiring safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Yeah, I hope so. I like you. You cool. You cool. I, I respect your hustle. But trolls have no business in Hogsmeade. That's off topic. <laughs> All right, what is next on our little quest quest is? All right, I think we will go on a dipulso and probably call it for the day. Seems like we got some pretty good stuff done. Didn't really beat up anybody or do anything too crazy today. I don't know. We'll see. Well, maybe I'll go do one little. One more quest, maybe it'll be a little bit more action bucked. All right, so go straight. Oh, I'm just going straight into. Oh wait, what? Where's the door to this place? Oh, here we go. Let's go into here. Maybe. Okay, here we go. Oh, 32 how dollars. Oh my goodness. I'm Hogwarts rich now. <laughs> Scuba Libba. Wait, what? It's locked? Why is it locked? Oh. <laughs> Whoops, I read that so wrong. I thought I got it. That's what I need to do. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right. It's fine. Quick little... Alright, so I think I got the potions last video. I do think I still need to get a focus one. So what I'll just go do real quick. I'll go buy one from the potioneer guy. Da, da, da. Right, let's just, whoops. Hopefully I have enough to buy the potion. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. How the people gonna uh, well, I guess it, can I buy the thingy now? Thunder brew focus. Uh, man, that is so much money. Okay. Let me good. Sell this. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. Yeah, I'll just buy the whole thing so I know how to make my own for permanent. You know, yeah. So let's just buy this. A wise decision. Uh, Thank you. Let's just get invisibility too, I guess, and then we'll get Thunderbolt lighter. We're not gonna again. afford it. Okay, so now let's go to the room of requirement real quick. I will go brew one of the potions. I will learn Depulso, and then hopefully I can do what's needed of myself. All right, my potion thing is on this side. Ah, no. <laughs> Oh, 
I don't even know what a flux weed is. <laughs> I should have just bought the potion. <laughs> well, I failed. Uh, poops. I'd like to ask you about changing. Of course. Oh. What's... I would like the room to feel. Hmm. Sounds perfect. All right. Let's see what that looks like real quick. I guess. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. I like this little ambiance. All right, well, uh, I duck farted that, guys. Sorry, if I had enough money, I could have learned Depolso. Maybe we will go learn Pop Balloons. I can do that one probably pretty effectively. Uh, oh, man, there's so many quests. Don't think I have a venomous to Nacula, do I? Nope. So I can't use that, but I have the other two things. I have the uh, poops. Oh, all right. I'll, I'll use. So I need to use Maximus and Idaris. So let's equip this. Dude, I look so sweet. Check me out. I'm all... Rock or ash? I don't know. Y'all, let me know what you think that is. I don't know. It looks more like a... A rock skin. Let's see. Let's change the ambiance real quick. I'd like to ask you about changing the room. No! Ambience. Of course! Where... I'd like the... Mm. Huh. Thank you again for changing the ambiance. Let's see what this one looks like. Hmm. Looks... Okay, whatever. I wonder if I'm still in my po... Aw, oh, man! Well, <clears throat> wanted to see what I looked like, but it's cool. It's fine, just fine. Okay. I guess I can go see what this is. I gotta assume I'll get to do some flying. Oh, I'm going all the way out over there. Okay, let's go here. All right, we'll do this and then we'll call it for the day. And then we'll pick up again later. All right, you guys. <laughs> These rocks have seen better days. <laughs> Drive by. <laughs> Alright. Pop balloons. I'm assuming those would be the balloons that it entails of popping. Alright. That's good. Start popping some balloons then. Alright, and first one, pop. Second one, pop. Third one, pop. Fourth one, pop. Is that the fifth? Why is that one red? Did I miss one? Okay, I'll just go pop one of those and see if that counts. I feel like I missed one somewhere. Let's see. Boop. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's cool, but not for my mission. What the poops? So where's... Where's that other... It was blue, right? How did I miss the fifth balloon? Revelio. Revelio, will you tell me where this balloon is, please? Let's go up higher. Nope, I don't s How... What? What happened? What happened? What happened? I can't see the balloon. 
soon. Yo, am I really that blind today, guys? <coughs> Revelio, my brother, you need to help me. <laughs> Where is this balloon? It does not exist. Alright, we'll, we'll back up a little bit. I'm going to go as high as I can go. Okay, maybe not as high as I can go. I feel like that's a little bit overkill. Now, I should be high enough to be able to see everything. Okay. Uh, yeah, y'all, I don't see this fifth balloon anywhere. Unless I got so far away, it's just it didn't spawn yet. So I'll slowly creep in. Yo. Hogwarts, did you uh, want me to complete this quest? I need to know where this other balloon is. I am quite stumped, people. Oh! I found it! Oh my goodness, that took forever. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, so now I just gotta go over to the Quidditch one. Okay. Sorry, guys. Oh, I just don't know how I missed that multiple times, but, uh, I did. So now we'll go get the ones over the Quidditch thing. We'll go learn the spell. And I will let y'all go so you guys can enjoy the rest of your night or day. And we'll see you in the next video. Oompa <laughs> Basqua. <laughs> so cool. Look at me just flying through little stuff. Alright, I'm going to go through that pillar down there because I'm that slick. Watch this. Oh, man. I'd be a Quidditch pro. All right. So we'll start all the way from over here. Just to... Oh. Okay. There we go. There's one. I see two and three. Okay. Three. Oh, okay, cool. I found them all this time. All right, hope. Hopefully, it doesn't take me too long to get them. Wow. And number five. Boom. Okay. All right, and let's just drop. Oh, wait. I'm not going into the school, so we'll just go right here, and let's go talk to Madame Kogawa. How did you get on with those <gasps> Dear Madame Kogawa, marvelous news that you'll be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our time near Yokohana Harbor. Though no one ever knows, I shall look forward to seeing you soon. If you have any questions in the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me an owl. Warm regards, Matilda Weasley. Revenue. Oh, is that, did that say level two? Madam Kogawa, oh, that's, I completed oh. the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Oh, I sure yes, did. Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. <laughs> well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Fulgore? Pay attention to your <laughs> wand work. <laughs> All right. Oh, good. And Oh, we zoom in. We is a zoom in. Cool. I learned another one. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office. All right, you ain't gotta tell me twice. I love learning new things. Um, let's get rid of that. Oh, whoops! I don't need it twice. Uh, we'll put Lumos back there. Okay. Places, there you go. Oh. That 
was pretty cool. Alright. And with that, we will call it a day. I would just like to thank you guys for joining us on this journey with Miss Alexa. I will be continuing this until I beat the game. I'll probably just kind of do more like the main story stuff to kind of keep progressing because the game's been out for a while and I have been kind of slacking on getting the game uploaded. But if you guys like the video, please leave a thumbs up on it. Um, if you have any questions or anything regarding the video or just in anything in general, please leave those in the comments below. But uh, other than that, oh, I would like to mention we are still doing the Road to 100. Uh, for people who still have any friends or family not subscribed to the channel, I know I sound like a broken record, but if we can please get them in there, we'd appreciate it. Just spread the word and then uh, we can all build this beautiful thing together and uh, yeah this has been the sus bros signing off